Good morning guys, my name is Trevor. Welcome back to the Arctic Vet YouTube channel. Today, we're not going to have a normal vlog. However, I do want to fill you guys in on something that's very important. Something that's hitting our community very hard. And we, we, we're trying to do something about it. So we're going to do what we can do about it. And that is exactly what this vlog is about. So I've got 22 letters right here. 22 letters, look at that stack ready to mail those puppies out i'm actually headed to get go put them in the mailbox right now but what we're doing is our half mile dirt track racetrack here in hutchison kansas at the kansas state fairgrounds it is under under attack it, it's going to be demolished the fair board plans to demolish it so far, they have no idea what they're going to even do with it. They haven't said what they're going to do with it. We There's a lot of talk. There's a lot of, well, they're going to do this. They're going to do that. There a lot of rumors going around. Don't know the truth, but I do know that they, they themselves don't even know what they're going to do. And they have to go to the state to get funding to do what they're going to do when they figure that out. And right now, I, from one of the meetings that we heard... You know, the state might just show them the cold shoulder and be like, mm, sorry, we're not going to help you guys. So, our problem is they're trying to get rid of our track. And honestly, if you guys are in the car world, in the racing world of any kind, this is a big attack that's not just happening here, but it's happening everywhere. NHRA tracks are getting shut down left and right. Left and right, these places are getting shut down. Like uh, Great Bend, where the NHRA actually started. I believe it's getting shut down as well. So, this is our time as car people, as race enthusiasts, car enthusiasts. Anybody, if you enjoy watching racing, if you race yourself, you're a driver, you're a pit crew guy, you know, whatever. You're just a supporter, a fan. This is our time to do something. And we have something to do and we need to do it by august 10th so that is what we're trying what i'm trying to help spread the word about and if you guys want to you can go over to facebook there is a group called chasing history save our in quotes framed half mile oval in quote in hutchison you can go join that group and in there you'll be able to find a whole bunch of stuff to where um I can add a link down in my description below, so check that out. I got this little blue cheat sheet here I'm reading off of. Um, you can sign the petition as well. We can put a link that, um, in the description for that. And also to the website of um, of this trying to save our track, they, with, they have an actual website you guys can go to, and it has even more information. If you're... If you're willing to or able to you can mail letters just like those 22 right there you can mail them to all the fair board members and to our governor but we have to do that one by april or april by august 10th so that's the one that i'm trying to get these out trying to get them done you have to put your name your address and then sign each of the letters and then you put a stamp on there, you put your return address, stick it in the mailbox, and off it goes. And hopefully, 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 they, they, they actually read them, and they receive so many that they, they read them. And they understand how big of a deal this really is. The, from the fair's perspective, from what we've heard, is that the track is used three days a year. And it doesn't bring enough income in for them. doesn't make enough revenue for them to even consider keeping it. But here's the thing. What happened to the tractor poles? I used to go to the tractor poles. I used to sit outside my grandpa's concession stand and listen to him do races and all sorts of stuff there as a kid. As a kid. So I know for a fact that there is so much more they could be doing with it. It's just not promoted. It's not there. So, anyhow, we also, they have a way that you can, you can email people. Uh, I can put their email addresses down below. Uh, there's a few of them there. You can contact the Reno County delegation. Uh, there's a link I can put on there. And then, obviously, the best, the best thing that we 
can do besides just doing all those other things is spreading the word, letting everybody know that this is something that's happening. It's real. And it's happening right here in Hutchison. So if you guys are able to, willing to help us out, go ahead, check my description below because that's where I'm going to put all the information that's on that blue paper. I'll put it all down there, all the links, everything. And I hope that I hope that we can get something done, change something because, man, it, the automotive world, look, I mean, that's what we do. The Arctic Vet Man, right there. Right there. Dora. Dorothy. And then over here, we got the quad. Go-karts. Dirt bikes. You know, that's what we do here. Uh, it's it's our thing. So it's our passion. And, it, and it's so much more than that. But, in, in other words, I've kind of been offline this whole week. I needed a little time to recoup from vacation, which we will get into in another vlog. So if you guys want to click that red subscribe button don't forget to smash the thumbs up share this video so that we can get the word out everywhere to anybody and everyone because anybody that is willing to help it's it's going to help even even one letter even one email even one donation it's gonna help so thank you guys so much i look forward to keeping you guys updated about this situation and i pray I pray that we have a much better outcome than demolishing the track. I don't I don't want to see that happen. So anyhow, we will catch you guys in another vlog. Have a blessed weekend and we will see you next time. God bless y'all. Don't ever give up. God is here with you. Yeah. You are a child. Nothing but love is true. Just got to fix your view. Keep your eyes on the prize. That's life everlasting only through Jesus Christ.